Hello, this is Father Rich Pagano here with you for the Solemnity of the Most Holy Trinity, a great feast day in the church, a most high feast day. And in this solemnity, we celebrate what Jesus Christ reveals to us. He reveals to us the perfection of the Father's love for us. Christ comes into our midst to sanctify us, not to condemn us, but to draw us into that perfect relationship that he shares with the Father in the power of the Holy Spirit. This great feast day has many gifts and blessings and calls us to a significant way of how we ought to live in the midst of the community. In 2 Corinthians, in the second reading for this upcoming weekend, we have from St. Paul an encouragement. Brothers and sisters, rejoice. Rejoice in this relationship that extends to us in the person of Jesus Christ. Mend your ways, encourage one another, agree with one another, live in peace, and the God of love and peace will be with you. Greet one another with a holy kiss. I remember back when I was a youth director at Santa Maria Del Mar in Flagler Beach, we had a, a lady who took care of the bookshop and the gift shop. And on the way out of church one day, she said, Richard, give me a kiss right here. Give me just a kiss right here. So of course, so I went in to give her a kiss. And then right when I was about to kiss her cheek, she just goes like this, like, and she gave me a kiss right on the lips. And then I was just kind of like surprised, like, whoa. <laughs> you know? But it was just, it was so beautiful. Like the, the affection that, that she had for me, the parish community had for me. And that really sent me off into the seminary and formation to priesthood. That sense of community, of, of really intentionally loving someone and, and really caring for them and wanting their welfare and their benefit in life, is what community is all about. So as we enter into this upcoming Sunday, I'm not encouraging you all to start kissing each other on the lips and making people feel uncomfortable, but to really truly, from the very depths of, of each of our hearts, to really engage one another and love one another. Live out these scriptures from 2 Corinthians and let us see the beautiful relationship of Holy Trinity, the Holy Trinity living out and breathing in our relationships with one another. Hey guys, thanks for watching our video. And if you want your mind to be blown, check out the link below. It's a book, Contemplating the Trinity by Rhaenyra Cantalamesa, preacher to the Holy Father. It will change your life.